Femi Ogunrombi, better known by his stage name Papara Hasko, is no longer alive. Due to his performance in Whale Adenuga's comedic series, the late Ogunrombi gained popularity. Haseni Shaibu, a theatre professional, shared the news that the talented thespian had passed away on Sunday via his Twitter account. I have just been reliably informed that the ethnomusicologist, former music instructor with Nation All Troop, and once stand-in for the Papara Hasko character on the popular Wally Danuga prod comic series Papara Hasko Mr. Femi Ogunrombi is dead, he wrote. When the previous character, Abide Inka, left the show, Ogunrombi assumed the role of Papara Hasko, and he continued playing the role for the duration of the show. Weyla Danuga created the Nigerian family sitcom Papara Hasko and Company, formerly known as the Hasko family, in 1996. The show is a spin-off of a 1984 feature film of the same name, which was directed by Weyla Danuga, and based on the comic book Ikip Super. The Hasko family and their comedic interpretations of major societal issues are the focus of the narrative. The patriarchal womanizer Papara Hasko, his long-suffering wife Mama Hasko, their mischievous son Bobo Hasko, the local playboy boy Alinko, the promiscuous gold digger Miss Bepier, and the illiterate Nedu Wells Pa James and Pa Jimmo, are the main characters. Papara Hasko was widely regarded as the most popular comedy series in Nigeria at its height, with weekly viewing in 12 African nations. Abidane Oinka, more commonly referred to as Papara Hasko, worked with the Lagos State Council for Arts and Culture and played a lead role in Papara Hasko and Company. He studied theatre arts and was a dancer in the past. In addition, he collaborated with numerous Yoruba movie producers and participated in joint productions. He went to IFE to get a certificate in dramatic arts after finishing secondary school. In 1985, he joined the Lagos State Council for Arts and Culture. To land the role of Papara Hasko, he appeared as a policeman in a comedy television series that was produced at the time by Wolamel. The producer, Mr. Weyladenuga, then looked for me and asked if I could play Papara Hasko. He said, let me try. As a result, he was cast in the role and inquired about the bald head. Therefore, the lady said, let me be natural, cut my hair, and when she later saw how it looked, she thought, wow.